Apple considered putting a camera in the Apple Watch's band. Apple Insider reports the design placed an optical sensor at the end of the flexible watch strap, allowing it to twist and turn to get a photograph you need without having to contort your wrist. Apple may never release a band with a camera, but the patent shows its thinking about how to make it work. Meanwhile, Amazon wants to use its drones to watch your home. The Telegraph spotted a patent for an unmanned aerial vehicle-based surveillance as a service that would be used for surveillance alerts and surveillance action done for a property. Amazon said that patents take years to receive and may or may not become a reality. Facebook pushing new rules for political ads worldwide. According to the new policy, advertisers that buy ads related to elections or other political issues need to verify their identity with Facebook and disclose who paid for the ad. The ads and the identity of the purchases are then preserved in Facebook's ad library for seven years, so anyone can see who paid for a particular ad. And a Commodore 64 clone with a working keyboard is coming. The Commodore 64, of course, one of the first personal computers. It was introduced in 1982. It's made by Retro Games. The company has been trying to replicate this for a couple of years, but just recently got enough money to do it. It will ship in December and cost $120. From the NASDAQ market site, I'm Jane King with your tech report.